I spoke with a few students who say this was unlike anything they'd ever seen before. They heard multiple gunshots, they saw people running out of the building, and they watched police handle large rifles. Brian Robb received a call from a neighbor that nobody ever wants to hear. The barn which holds his livestock was up in flames and starting to crumble. Big topic of conversation tonight is the odor coming from that Winnebago County landfill. Hundreds march with the Rockford Mayor Thomas McNamara to bring awareness to domestic violence. TSA officers talked extensively about the items that they see passengers try to sneak through security, such as knives disguised as lipstick, keys, and hairbrushes, things officers can easily detect. Yes, Micah Chin, and I am here at the Sickle Gas Station off of 11th Street here in Rockford. Right now, what we do know is that the man who was the 30-year-old victim who was stabbed in the neck, he did arrive at the hospital, and police are saying he does have potentially life-threatening injuries. According to Jewish leaders, there are around 600 Jewish people in the city. And after this morning's shooting, many were concerned that this might impact those living in our area. After speaking with many motorcycle riders, they say driving on grass clippings can be just as slippery as ice, causing many, many motorcycle accidents. Close friends and family came together with balloons, flowers, and candles. Not just to celebrate Mother's Day, but to celebrate Zachary's son Shaquille's 24th birthday. Life-saving skills were put to the test at the first responders from multiple agencies responded to this mock airplane crash involving 150 volunteers acting as passengers. A nationwide organization called Fight Crime Investing Kids has found that children who have high quality education in preschool are more likely to stay out of trouble. In June of 2018, the city of Rockford was forced to file a lawsuit against A.W. Bennett, the company which owns Essex, because they wouldn't demolish the blighted property after the city asked multiple times. 